hey guys welcome back to my channel thank you so very much for clicking on this video i really appreciate you stopping by and i want to say thank you thank you thank you yeah we are 500 subscribers i want to be too happy so that somebody don't unsubscribe but i want to say thank you thank you thank you thank you for 500 subscribers it took forever but you know what i am happy and grateful that you guys decided to follow me thank you so much so today i want to talk about ysl and its price increase that happened on november 1st 2022 so i went to the store today is the third i went to the store to just look at stuff and i realized like you know i know the price increase was gonna happen but i really never paid interest because i was like another price increase whatever you know so right now i can officially say that i can't tell anybody else anybody that ysa is the most affordable luxury house in terms of bags i guess i can still say that because when you compare it with some you know of their like colleagues you know bags the prices are a little bit more affordable affordable in quotation because obviously you know what affordable means when it comes to luxury but let's talk about which way I sell bag you should still get even though after the price increase of 2022 the latest price increase okay let's get into I have a couple ways of bags I'm gonna talk about that I have two bags here and then I'm just gonna compare with some other you know uh, bags from other brand house to see like how if it's like a, a good deal by still buying bags from them or so you just forget them because since two three years ago they've just been going with this price increase i just don't understand it's like okay we know that you are having this like moment but calm down chill it down i don't want to be associated they told me yes we're trying to compete with the other houses you don't have to compete with her you okay i can buy 10 of you bags and i'll be comfortable because i like your price your price your price right now but not right now because obviously you know how it is so the eye here maxi bags shopping tote that I came out with the CAA as one of the big ridiculous biggest ridiculous bag ever shutting down social media is the maxi I came maxi shopping tote and that one is 4,900 when you compare that with the I mean I don't want to compare that with the Chanel R22 because the, the in terms of like the sizing but whenever i see that bag it always reminds me of the chanel 22 i don't know why even though the sizes are so different i don't know why but it's ridiculous but uh, that bag is 4900 from i guess what i just saw on the on their website so just in case you're you want you know because that's the thing that is hyped right now that's not my cup of tea you will never see on in my collection because i'm not gonna ever ever buy a bag like that if that's one something you want go ahead but i will never recommend bag like that because how many things are you gonna carry inside like it's too big excessive and i just don't know what i'm gonna buy. i probably have to put myself in the bag which doesn't make sense then who's gonna carry me god will carry me anyway the second bag i want to talk about is the look camera bag <laughs> I think it was at 1500 before um and right now it's going at it's at $1,690 which I don't understand I mean it surpassed the Gucci bag the Gucci camera bag the moment camera bag which I have right here really is the same thing as this bag and which I will always go for this Gucci when you when you compare and feel the leather I would definitely go for this bag because I was wearing it a day when I felt the leather to that one just to feel the you know comparison I'll always go for this bag and I don't know in terms of resale market I don't know how they're going really but for like usage and for like quality of the bag and durability I definitely go with that I don't know about like the durability for YSL bag but because I've used this I can actually uh, attest to this the, the, the quality of that bag and right now this is $1,650 so why is it like $40 more expensive and mind you Gucci bag came out before that I guess and it was Gucci bag was more this bag was more expensive than the camera uh, the tow camera the loo camera bag 
but now the look camera bag is more expensive than this bag by forty dollars so that's what that's how life happens so i would definitely go for this for me before i go for that but it's whatever it's you know however you want it but this is my recommendation this one this is the bags i think definitely i'll wake up tomorrow and decide this is what i want the next one i want to talk about is the lulu line so they have the medium the small and the large the small right now is two thousand nine hundred and fifty dollars <laughs> the medium is three thousand two hundred dollars the large is $3,450 and when you think about it I literally still go for the medium because this is um, this is I, I guess comparison wise you say Lulu the tall Lulu and this one is probably the same size this is Bulgari forever bag and literally is the same thing and this is going for $3,700 so it's almost $500 more expensive more than $500 more expensive than the Lulu uh, Lulu in medium so I would definitely recommend the medium I don't know about the large uh, I guess if you're more like uh, like the thicker ladies or taller ladies then maybe the large and then yeah I mean the small is still under under $3,000 she now have that little affinity bag for four thousand something so it's i can say it's still a little bit uh, uh, cheaper so i recommend that one for sure not cheaper i'll say it's a more a little bit more affordable i'll definitely be you know still going for the lulu line uh blue miguel if you're still interested right now the medium that is right now three thousand two hundred dollars they have it at two thousand eight hundred and fifty dollars so they still have it they haven't like up or uh, bumped their um price if you want the bag right now just go ahead go to blooming girl and bloomingdale sorry blooming girl bloomingdale and <coughs> get your bag right now don't wait a minute okay so now we're going to talk about the next bag is the wire so sunset <coughs> and I have it right there and it's the medium just want to let you know that I recommend this bag if you're interested in getting it because if you're about to go get the Chanel bag is $8,800 this one right now is $2,700 so it's like $6,100 lesser than this bag uh, more than this bag so you're going to pay more money when you buy the Chanel small classic flap and i could always go for this because you can wear this crossbody i don't know if you can wear this small chanel crossbody though and then next one i want to talk about is my sack disorder and it is this one this one is the baby one i also got this for less than 18 dollars from 18 dollars 18, $1, from tj maas and right now the baby is going at two thousand eight hundred and fifty dollars and this the nano the smaller one is going at two thousand five hundred dollars so when you look at the ceiling luggage bag in mini that one is almost three thousand dollars i think it's two thousand nine hundred and something about that and this is still two thousand eight hundred and fifty dollars so i could always recommend this I know it's a little bit stiff but the leather and i mean i've had this for like a year going to a year now um less than a year and i still you know i love the way it wears it's a more handheld bag than any other thing um and i always recommend that sag de jour if you want to go for nano fine if you want a smaller bag than that but this carries more of my essentials my everyday essentials and the last bag i want to talk about i'm not gonna you know take a whole the whole time because it's already happened is the envelope bag I'm very interested in the envelope bag and the medium one thing I'm confused about I don't know if they made this small the medium now because I can't find this small and the one that they have as the medium is two thousand nine hundred and fifty dollars 
and the one that they have as a small is more like a crossbody rather than the one with the two uh, chain and that one is going for $2,650 and <clears throat> I'm kind of confused because I don't know which one because the one I was looking at is the smaller one with two chain that you can wear on the shoulder and also crossbody but the one they I saw on their website that is the small is the one that you can only carry as a crossbody and then the one that you can two chain and carry as crossbody is not a medium please leave a comment let me know because that does not sound right that does not make because i think the one you wear on a crossbody as a crossbody is supposed to be more like a wallet on the chain something because i don't think it's spacious enough for it to be called a small bag but i don't know i have never seen that one i think but literally that is the YSL bag and the price increases that happened um, November 1st 2022 let me know your <coughs> leave a comment let me know what you think um, leave a comment let me know your opinion about this price increases and where, where you think we're going so that is it for today please leave a comment and let me know what you think about this price increase we need to find a way to like stop this price increases if not then if you constantly buy this price this bags whenever the price increase happen or after the price increase happen then they will think it's normal that you know eventually even if they can do anything that we can do anything because we'll eventually buy the bag it this is disgusting and it pisses me off anyways thank you so much i'll see you in my next Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye-bye now.